discuss about the farewell to arms uh, uh, is a novel by american writer i ernest hemingway to say during the italian campaign campaign of world war the first first published in 1929 it is a first person account of an american uh, frederick henry serving as a, a lieutenant or italian tenente in the ambulance um, crops of the italian army okay the novel describes the love affair between the expert sorry expatriated from america and an english nurse catherine barclay it uh, its publication ensued hemingway's place as a modern american writer of considerable stature the book became his first best seller and he has been called the uh, premier american or novel from world war the first the title might be taken from a 16th century poem of the same name by the english dramatist george peely the novel has been adapted a number of times initially for the stage in 1930 as a film in 1932 and again in 1957 and as a three part television mini uh, series in 1966 the film with in love and or made in 1996 uh, depicts hemingway's life in italy as an ambulance driver in events um, prior to his writing of a farewell to arms now the plot summary is the no the novel is divided into five sections or books frederick henry narrates the story in the first person book one where uh, lieutenant lieutenant uh, frederick henry an american medic is serving in a, in the italian army the novel begins during the first world war it is the start of winter when a surely era epidemic uh, kills thousands of soldiers frederick has a brief visit to uh, Gorzio, where he meets with other army fellows and the British. He finds there are two brothers, one for officers and the other for lower rank soldiers. Once, uh, on his returns, he shares his experience with his friends, Sir John uh, Rinaldi, um, quite older than him. Rinaldi is fond of beautiful women. He has fallen in love with an English nurse named Catherine Barclay. Though not for, so seriously, uh, Rinaldi takes uh, Frederick to a British hospital where Frederick is introduced to uh, Catherine. Frederick feels attracted towards her. She tells him about her fiancé who was killed in the uh, in the battle and also about her feelings uncomfortable in the rain as it starts to rain frederick tries to kiss her but she refuses and slaps him feeling sorry thereafter eventually they kiss as now she feels somewhat uh, inclined towards him frederick with his follow dry uh, drivers um, takes the ambulance in or Passini is killed in a mortar attack, whereas Frederick is severely wounded in the knee on the Italian front and is sent to the hospital. In the book, too, uh, Sergeant Rinaldi visits Frederick in the hospital and praises him for his heroism. But Frederick denies of any display of heroism. Rinaldi also tells him that he will be shifted to a hospital in Milan soon for a better treatment. Frederick requests him to have Catherine there as a nurse. The priest plays a visit in a discussion again. Frederick expresses his views against war. Meanwhile, America has declared war on Germany and the Italian army is also anxious about war against Austria. Frederick reaches an American hospital in Milan. There he is nursed by Miss Gaggy. 
Mrs. Walker and dear Superintendent Miss Van Campen, Miss Gay, uh, Miss Gazy arranges wine for him. Catherine arrives there and Frederick realizes a strong sense of love and passion for her. They make love for the first time. Dr. Val Valentini comes to examine his injury and x-ray. This book portrays the growth of Frederick's relationship with Catherine over the summer. They enjoy his boating and horse races. Meanwhile, Frederick meets Helen uh, Ferguson, a fellow nurse of Catherine. After his knee heals, Frederick is uh, diagnosed with uh, Juandice, uh, a three weeks con the convalescent lives in sanction for him. Miss Van Campen discovers some empty liquor bottle in Frederick's room and takes alco uh, alcoholism as the cause for his condition. She also concludes that Frederick is knowingly keeping himself ill to avoid the war front. She flies a report for the cancellation of uh, con Convalescent leave, and Frederick is called back to the war front. Catherine informs him and that uh, she is uh, three months pregnant. They promise to reunite and marry after his return from war. Frederick asks her to take care of little Catherine. Now, in the book, th book three, Frederick returns to. Uh, Gori's Zia, uh, Rinaldi comes and examines his wounded legs. He further asks whether they have married or not. The priest notices a change in Frederick and also uh, predicts that the war will end soon. Frederick travels to uh, ben, uh, Benciza where he meets Giono who tells him about an uh, artillery battery of terrifying guns that the Austrians have. Frederick realizes that Italians will not escape in the uh, Austrians' attack. It rains heavily and uh, the bo bombarding begins. Frederick discovers that Morali has severely dropped. Not long afterward, the uh, austro uh, um, Hungarians breaks through the Italian alliance in the Battle of uh, Caporito and the Italians retreat. The houses are uh, evacuated, women and children are loaded in trucks. At the villa, Henry discovers that uh, Rinaldi has taken off for, for the hospital. Everyone else uh, has uh, evacuated too. There is considerably delay and chow cows uh, on the road during the retreat, and Frederick, wishing to avoid a possible aerial attack while stuck on the main uh, retreat route, decides to take an alternate path. He and his men quickly get lost, and their cars are stuck in the mud. Frederick orders the two engineering uh, sergeants uh, riding with Boleno to help. Afraid of being overtaken by the enemy, by they refuse and try to leave. Frederick draws his gun and shoots one of the and uh, the other escapes. One of the drivers, uh, Mo, is later killed, while another, Bonello, runs away to surrender to the Australians. Uh, Frederick and his last companion. Uh, Piani catches up to the main retreat across the uh, Taglia Amento River. As soon as they cross the bridge, Frederick is taken by the military police to the uh, to a place on the river bank where officers are being interrogated and uh, executed for the treachery that uh, sup uh, supposedly led to the Italian defeat. Frederick escapes by jumping into the river. Afterwards, he walks through the plains and jumps aboard a moving train to Milan to find Catherine. In book 4, reaching Milan, he learns that Catherine has left for Stresha. She goes to visit Ralph Simons, one of the 
a pair of singers that he encountered earlier and asked about the procedures for traveling to Switzerland. Ralph helps him, giving him civilian clothes. Frederick feels very odd in those clothes. The people look at him scornfully. He reaches uh, Teresa by train and goes to the hotel. Is less borrow means. Emilio, a bartender, informs him that two English nurses are staying at a small hotel near the train station. Frederick meets Catherine and Helen Ferguson, Ferguson there. He also meets Count uh, Graffy, a very old noble man who pay, whom Frederick had met on his last visit to uh, Teresa. Graffy is staying with his nice. Frederick avoids Catherine's question about the war experiences. He feels that he is a criminal of war uh, disaster. Emilio informs him that Italian police are looking to arrest him. Catherine and Frederick plan to flee to Switzerland. Also, Emilio makes all possible arrangements for their travel in a rowboat because of a storm the waters are choppy and rough Patrick rows the boat all night and Catherine also takes a turn rowing finally they reach Switzerland the guards verifying their identity and provide them for uh, provisional visas for staying in Switzerland in Book 5, Frederick and Catherine live a quiet life in the mountains. They move to a wooden house on a mountain outside the village of Montrex. They develop new acquaintance with Mr. and Mrs. Guttingen. At time, Catherine starts getting uh, concerned about their child, especially about its health. They move to the town of uh, Lausanne to be closer to the hospital. Later, Catherine goes into labor and, it, uh, and is taken to the hospital. The doctor tells Frederick that the best solution would be a uh, caesarean operation. She suffers a lot of pain and finally delivers a stillborn baby boy. Later, the nurse tells him that Catherine is uh, uh, Homer hanging. Uh, sorry, Homer, uh, Homer hanging. Uh, he is terrified. He goes to see her and uh, she dies in his arms. He leaves the hospital and walks back to to his hotel in the uh, uh, sorry, uh, in the uh, in the rain. Okay, that is a nice story. Um, very, very much sorrowful. So I like this story and the, st the story is Ordenville is a farewell to ours.